What is up Guitar Legends, Sam Wild here. We're looking at Hear You Me today by Jimmy Eat World. This is a really easy song, so you guys are gonna pick up super fast. It's quite a long song, but there's just lots of things repeating, so we can actually race through this one. Uh, you need the cap on fret two. Let's dive straight into the chords, all right? We're gonna need D major. Okay, pause the video and practice this if you need to. Same with all of the shapes. We're gonna move through them a little quickly. The next one is A sus four. So you can see I moved my first and second finger up, but the third finger stayed there. Okay, so you can see that it's a very small movement there to change chords. Also, we now want the open E string for the next three chords, including this one. All right. Uh, for B minor seven, instead of having to play a bar chord, we can just keep this uh, A sus shape we've already got here. Just move one thing, the first finger up one string. You get a B minor seven. All right, and finally the last chord, we're just gonna bring the second finger up. So we get a G chord. Now if you listen carefully in the song, we still have this open E. Okay, so really it's like a G6 chord. All right, but just the nature of going from one to the other, it doesn't really sound like a typical six chords, <laughs> you know, it, it kind of just just sounds like there's loads of open strings, it's really nice. So these four chords we use for most of the song, okay, in fact we can use them for the whole song pretty much. Um, there's one more shape which we'll look at uh, when we get to the chorus part, all right. So let's just talk about the rhythm quickly. Bear in mind the song is in three, four, it goes one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, there's three beats per bar. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna have a down up for each of those beats. Like that. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Just constant strumming for the whole song. Now, my tip for changing chords, change on the last up, you want to be moving the fingers as you're coming up, so they're ready, watch. So as I'm coming up, I'm changing chord, so I'm ready, okay, don't try and change really super fast, okay, you can change on the last up from it doesn't really matter. For those of you that wanna take your playing to the next level, make sure you sign up to my premium membership website. You'll gain access to all my backing tracks, all of my lessons, and I'll teach you how to improvise, solo, and play advanced chords. Enjoy the rest of your lesson, guys. All right, so now we've got the rhythm and the chords down, we can just dive straight into the structure, move through this nice and quickly. The first thing we have is sort of like an intro to the intro. All right, so we're gonna play D major for four bars, or one, two, three. Then the intro comes in. So you can see that I've written out. We've got D there. And then we're gonna have the D to A sus to B minor 11 to G progression. All right, still an intro, no singing here. So again, it goes all one, two, three, one, two, three, then A sus, one, two. So we've got four bars on each one. Then B11, minor 11. get to verse one. There's no one in town I know. So one tip I've got for the getting this to kind of feel nice, it's good to strum nice and loudly on that first drum and then just stick to the these uh, lower down strings here for the rest, watch. Second verse. So this first verse we actually played twice, okay? 
Uh, then we get to the chorus. Now for the chorus, um, we can play the chords a little quicker. Okay, so we go one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. So it's D then A then G, D, A sharp, G. On the third time though, C plus rose the C plus go. We have an E minor last time. It's back to A sus G. Okay, so you can see the third time round in this chorus, we have E minor. Really easy. Okay, so we've gone from D to A sus. All, right, all you do for E minor, move finger one and two up a string, both of them. You get this E minor shape, right? It literally happens once in the chorus on the third time round the chords. Now it's a little tricky to be changing chords faster. So again, remember to change chord on that final up of each strumming pattern. So verse two, uh, the same as verse one, but it's not a double verse, it's just a one verse, okay? Then we're gonna go into chorus two, which is the same as chorus one, so that's fine. All right, now after this second chorus, however, we are gonna go into a bridge. So this is the part that goes. Okay, so a couple of variations here. So we have the B minor 11 chord again for this bridge, but this shape sounds a little bit weird. So the best thing to do is just play B minor, just play the bar chord, okay? Uh, then we're gonna go to our G chord, okay? And you can even add in this. If you can reach, most of you will probably struggle to reach your pinky across there, but E string, fifth fret from capo, you can add that note in, okay? So we have B minor, then G. Read your cross for the last two, if you want to. B minor again. A sus, G. So you notice the second time there's an A sus there. So we add the B minor, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2
So we're playing down, down, up, up, down, down, down. Okay. Then we get to the G chord. And again, we're going down, down, up, up, down, down. So you need to have the first finger ready because we're gonna we're gonna try and get this within the chord. Okay, so you start with the third finger as normal. Then we have, you can see our strum with that first finger there, second from the B string. And then I hammer on the third finger back down. string and first finger on second fret of the E string like that within the chord okay once the third finger is back down you can leave it there and you can even though we're strumming everything you can try and just mainly strum the strings we're trying to hit here So the whole thing so far. Okay, then the second time round, we want to go. Okay, so again, we start the same. So that bit's the same. Then for G, quite difficult, but we're going to go. The first finger starts flat, B string, second fret, but try and position it so that it's in place to then curl up onto second fret, the G string. So you got this flat, curl, flat, curl, flat, curl. Okay, so it's flat, then curl, flat, then curl. So the first line, everything so far, we have. Okay, then the second time round, we start the same. The only thing is, now we have to try and get in the E minor chord, right? Because it's the third time. There. And that makes it harder to get the... Because your first finger's up here for E minor, you have to suddenly drop it down. Okay, so you can kind of come out of the E minor chord early if you want to, to make it easier. Then we finish the same. Okay, so this, they're both the same. Our first half is the same as the second half, we just have to worry about that E minor chord. Again, if this solo is a little tricky for you, it's no big deal, just play the chorus chords, it works just fine. All right, after the solo section, which is basically just a chorus uh, with a guitar solo, uh, we're gonna go into verse three, right? But once again, we have this kind of intro into verse three. So we play the D chord for four bars after the solo. Okay, then we have verse three. And if you were with me tonight. So play nice and softly here. And to you just one more time. Song for a heart, then build it up. Now we're on to chorus number three. All right, so to finish this song off, we're going to have this chorus three here. All right, but then we have a fourth chorus. Okay, that's when the singing gets a little bit higher, a little bit more intense. But just watch out, right at the end of the song when we have um, On sleepers rose, the sleepers go May angels lead you in We're gonna do that part again On sleepers rose, the sleepers go May angels lead you in And then we just finish there. I like to do one strum Just to finish that off, right? All right, there you have it, guys. You are ready to play the whole song with me. So the play-along is coming up. 
uh, just see how far you get. Any parts you struggle with, those are the parts you need to work on the most. All right? If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell icon too. All right? Thanks so much for watching, guys. Good luck with the play along. I will see you in the next video. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh